portable document format. PDF files by their nature are not being allowed to be edited. What if there is a need for you to edit your PDF files? Maybe you've written a report which you have saved as a PDF file. In one way or the other, you want to edit this PDF file by adding some text, removing some, or even go ahead and add some extra pages. The good news is that there's a way you can edit your PDF files. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to edit PDF files. And I will specifically show you how to edit PDF files in Canva. Coming up. Hello guys, this is Sonic here from Template Warriors. On this channel, we help you create and sell digital products online and also help small businesses grow using the right digital tools through online video just like this one. So if you are new here, consider subscribing. That said, let's jump into the video. So to edit my PDF files, I need to sign into my Canva account. After signing into Canva, what I need to do is simply drag and drop the PDF files in here. I have my PDF files here and this is the first one I'm going to try to edit. I just click on it and drag it in here like this. I can minimize this for now. And right here is the file which is uploading right now. So you patiently have to wait for it to finish uploading. All right, the file is uploaded. I just go ahead and click on it, which will open in a new tab. I exit out of here. I don't need it. And I have my PDF document right here, which is just three pages. In here, you see that the text is not in proper shape, so I can just click on it. Then I go ahead and open it up like this, just to make it in line. I'll zoom it a bit. In here, if I want to change this name, I can easily enable it. Then I'll go ahead and enter in the new name. Perfect. Maybe I will change annual to monthly. So that it will be monthly report. I'll go ahead and open it up so that it will fit well. I can also increase the width of the rectangular shape behind. Awesome. I want, I can even change this image right here. I can go over to photos. Maybe I need real estate related images. I search. I'll just go ahead and choose this one. I'll go ahead and open it up to fit the exact size like this. Maybe I'll take it here. I can even add in some text if I want. And I'm going to go ahead and add a heading. I'll take it here for June. So this is monthly report for June. I'll go ahead and align it to the left. I can reduce it from here. And I'll go ahead and align it to monthly report on top right here. Perfect. If you want to change the font, you can go over here and change it. I'll leave it as it is for now. Going down to the second page, I can change this text here. That is company name. Just select it. I open it up first of all and I enter template warriors. If I want to make the page number bold, I select it and I click on bold. Then I go ahead and open it up like this. This text is not in line, so I just open it up like this. Awesome. Maybe the whole of this text here, I don't need it. I'll just take it off. And I can pull in an image right here. So I go over to photos and I just choose any of these images. I shrink it down and I move it to this location. Perfect. If you are finding value so far, please give this video a thumbs up. It does help me out so that the video will be suggested to more people on YouTube and also benefit more people. All right, let's continue. Maybe in here, I want to add in some more text. So I enable my insertion point. I hit enter. Then I just go ahead and add in the new text. So at the moment, my document is three pages long. I can add in more pages like this. And I can go ahead and do whatever design I want to put in there. I'm just going to go ahead and demonstrate and show you how you can add more pages to your PDF file. Maybe I need some text. I will say 
end of page now go ahead and shrink it down if i want i can even add a page in between the already existing pages maybe in between page two and page three i want to add in a new page so i'll go to page two and i click on the plus icon right here to have a new page inserted so if you are done editing your file you can go ahead and save it as pdf again the suggested file type is png i drop down the arrow and i go ahead and choose either pdf standard or pdf print i'll choose pdf standard and i'm going to go ahead and download all the five pages from here you go ahead and click on download i'm not going to download this file so now we have seen how we can edit a pdf file the question now is is it possible to edit all pdf files my answer is no if the pdf file is a skilled one it will be impossible for you to edit it in Canva. Some other tools may be able to do that, but not possible in Canva at the moment. First of all, let me exit out of here. Then I go over to my folder. This second document here is a secure PDF file. Let me open it up. You see that the file is open and on top here, after the name of the file, you see into brackets secured. This means that this particular file is a secured file. So I'll go ahead and close it up. So now let's see if we'll be able to edit it in Canva. So I'll just go ahead and drag it in here. I can minimize this for now. File is uploading right here. All right, the upload couldn't complete. Now if I hover on the document down here below, you see that document couldn't be imported because the file is encrypted. So this tells us that we cannot really edit a secured file with Canva but it's highly possible to edit any pdf file that is not secured you may not be able to edit your file perfectly but at the end of the day it will take you somewhere so that's it on how to edit pdf files in canva all right that's it guys i hope you found value in today's video if you did kindly hit the like button subscribe if you have not yet subscribed and also enable the notification bell so that each time i post a new video on this channel will be the first to know. Keep watching and I'll see you in the next one.